guys, welcome back. I hope you enjoy this smoky New Year's tutorial and let's get right to it. To start off this look, I'll be taking this pink shade for my transition color from the Tartlet Matte Palette and just placing that in my crease. Going in with this darker shade from the same palette, I'm just going to be building that crease color, just starting to create the smoky effect so the black shades that we go in with later blend in nicely. Because we're using really dark colors in this look, just make sure you are taking your time with the blending so you don't have any harsh lines. Going in with ColourPop Shadow Shock Shadow in Roulette, I'm just going to be applying this onto the entire lid with my fingers. Um, you will see me go in later on with a brush and this is just to make sure that it's all blended out and even. And then for this especially, you want to make sure that you are taking that time and really blending this out to give that smoky effect. This step is optional. I'll be going in with this green glitter from Revlon and this is just going to be my base. If you have glitter glue, you can skip this part and just place the black glitter on top. But I'm just going to place that as my base and then as you see here, going in with the black glitter over top. Repeat the same step on the other eye and apply lashes and now I'm going to go in and highlight under my eyes, the bridge of my nose, forehead, cupid's bow, and chin. Going in with a damp beauty blender, I'm just going to blend this all out and then set my under eyes with my Bobbi Brown Pale Yellow Powder. To contour, I'll be going in with this Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette and just contouring my cheeks, forehead, under my chin, and my nose. eyes I'll be going in with those same two Tarte palette colors and I will also be going in with a dark black and just blending it out with a fluffier pencil brush really make sure to focus on blending these colors out for my waterline I'll be going in with this L'Oreal infallible jumbo black liner and just placing this in my waterline just to make the eye appear smaller and more cat eye up next is mascara and for mascara I will be using L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black and just placing this on my lower lash line and a little bit on my upper lash line as well. This has to be one of my favorite blushes right now. This is Sigma Cora De Rosa and this is one of their Aura powders. So I'll just be placing this on my cheeks and the tip of my nose. Going in with this highlighter from MAC, this is Soft and Gentle. I will just be highlighting the top of my cheeks, uh, my cupid's bow under my brow, and the bridge of my nose. For a added plump to my lips, I'll be going in with this Full Lip Enhancer, and this one is in the size medium. And then for lips, I will be going in with Gerard Cosmetics. This is a Hydra Matte Liquid Lipstick and this one is in the color Iced Mocha. I do have a 25% off discount code, which is right here. Um, so feel free to use that code to get a little bit of money off your purchase. Let me know if you guys are interested in seeing a video on the full lip enhancers and I will make sure to get that up for you guys. And to complete this look, I will just be going in with my setting spray. This one is from Victoria's Secret and that is it guys. Um, this look is complete. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment below on what you'd like to see next. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up and until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye!